I'm Danica Patrick, and I'm pretty intense. You know, coming off a perfect game, I think the beauty is to is to be critical of that the same way you're critical of a of a really rough game. You know, where you throw interceptions, you mm. fumble the ball, or you lose because of mistakes you made. Um, you have to approach both of those the same way, mm. um, and that goes for the media that you. Uh, that you choose to look at or don't look at, it, it cannot be all the positive on the great weeks and don't look at anything on the bad weeks. It, for me, it's really, unless there's something that I need to see that, that you know, Tom Fanning sends me, it's, you know. You don't look at much? I don't look at hardly yeah, anything. Yeah, I don't, I mean, yeah. it's... I don't look at any of that when we win and don't look at any of that when we lose. You're like, so, you lived it. And that's the mindset. You know how it went. Yeah, and that's the mindset. It has to be, you know, you have a place for all that. And the place is, I'm critical of the wins. I'm critical of the losses, what I can do better, how my attitude was out there, how my leadership was, what plays do I have to be smarter about, how my preparation was the, those weeks, what made it better than others. Um, I think you're always self-scouting. That's a you know football term. But in life, you're always kind of, self-scouting you're kind of taking inventory on what's been working lately habitually you know like what habits have i been doing that work for me what do i need to change what would i like to do better you know i think that's just kind of a lifestyle so when it's a lifestyle that you know you don't get too high and low with the so you do the, the same thing losses. either way really yeah i mean i always say i hate losing more than i love winning and i really love winning so you hate the feeling, but you have to find a spot for that feeling because. Yeah. What do you mean find a spot? Like what? What does that mean to you? It means deal with it and, and put it in its place. It can't be sticking with you. Okay. Then Compartmentalize. The, yeah, into the next week. So when's the first time you address it after a game? Because first, I mean, people well, should I know talk to the you're media. impressive after you get home from a game that doesn't go well, or even when I've talked to you after a game that doesn't go well, you're like, eh, you know, whatever. All right, I'll be home. You know, you're able to compartmentalize seemingly to me really well, or get over it really well. Well, it's definitely not that I don't care. I mean, of course, I no, care I I know so much. <laughs> I know, but I the just, ability to sh turn that off is is well, it's impressive. The balance. It's the balance. I think you have to have that balance. You know, it's probably my cheery attitude. I don't think I'm talking like that to you know Lafleur or my teammates or yeah. Getzy or Hack. You know, like. We're pretty honest about how I played, what we got to do better. You know, it's frustrating when you lose. It's great when you win, but there's still things to clean up all the time. Yeah. Well, there's probably no game that has more self analyzation than football, I would think, as far as sports. Well, they all do now. I mean, they all, they, they definitely all do now. They don't have as many days to look at that film, though. Well, they get to, they get to repeat pretty quickly. Yeah. yeah. Basketball plays two or three a week, and baseball plays, you know, four or five a yeah. week. And, Hockey plays two or three weeks. You have a chance to kind of rebound. Football, you have to sit with it for longer. So yeah. you learn over the course of your career, like how to. You well, in racing, move it was on. the same. I mean, racing was one weekend to the next. And so you know, there's always a saying, like, you're only as good as your last race. And you have to sit on that thought and that feeling for the, for one, from one week to the next. And I have for sure, as you know, my spirited attitude. I have for sure let a bad weekend slip into the next to the next, and then all of a sudden you spiral out of control. Um, so I think it's harder to not have a game to come back to right away than it is to have to sit with it. But you do a really good job. Thank you. Yeah. Just give um, me some cupcakes and some I make you cupcakes when you come home, only if you on win, though. Quickly. Only if you win.